So ever since the expansion of major social media sites on the internet and the popularity of media streaming platforms like YouTube and Twitch, viewbots became very common almost exactly at the same rate. When something good grows in popularity, unfortunately there are people out there that are going to try and exploit that system. With the correlation between YouTube views and ad revenue, people created viewbots to cheat the system. And today we're going to be one of those people. Little disclaimer before I actually start this video, this is completely an educational video. I'm not telling you to do this, alright, I'm just going to show you how it's done. We good? Alright, let's go. Let's get on with the video. So we're going to be making a very basic viewbot written in Python. And here are the basic things we need in our code. A link to the videos we're trying to generate views and an arbitrary amount of views that we actually want to generate on this YouTube video. So the process we're taking with this bot is actually very, very simple. We're creating a web clicker bot that will simply load up the YouTube video, watch it for a couple of seconds and then refresh the page. The viewbot will repeat this process in the background until we tell it to get the amount of views that we actually want. Alright, so at this point I got the bot working on a random video I found on YouTube and now I decided to try it on one of my videos. I uploaded a 10 second video to my YouTube channel and made it unlisted. So with the current algorithm, the view bot refreshes the page and generates one view every two seconds. That means I'm getting 30 views every minute, 1800 views every hour and 43,200 views in 24 hours. At this pace, it'll take roughly about three and a half weeks to get to a million views. But that's not enough. I need to speed up the process, optimize the calculation, get snappy, super fast runtime complexity, and somehow make it possible to get a million views within 24 hours. So here's the plan. I'm gonna write some JavaScript code to open 30 tabs within one window. And then within each of those tabs, I'm gonna be running my Python script. Then I could write some more JavaScript code to then open five more of these 30 tab windows, exponentially increasing the amount of views I'm getting per minute. Do you understand how many tabs I'm gonna be having open? Then I could actually increase it up to probably 10 different windows, running 30 different tabs, which are... So my PC almost crashed because apparently opening 500 Chrome tabs is not the best idea. Fortunately, I was able to recover everything. I just shut down my PC and restarted everything. So after my PC almost blew up, I checked my YouTube analytics and my video somehow got only 173 views. <laughs> You serious? I'm sure YouTube has a system in place to prevent high traffic requests being made from the exact same IP address, which is what I was doing here. I was making super high traffic requests from the exact same IP address. So if I could somehow modify my IP address or proxy within each iteration, then I could probably get to a million views. But that seems like too much work, so I just, I'd rather not. So here's my takeaway from this video. Even if I was somehow able to reach a million views, it actually wouldn't even mean much. And the reason why is that the YouTube algorithm and monetization process isn't actually based on views. It's based on watch time. And my bot that I coded was simply watching the video for like two seconds every iteration. Even if I was able to get a million views, each of those million views were only two seconds. Anyway, I hope you guys all learned something from this video. I hope it was entertaining as well. If you enjoyed it, remember to give it a like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you would like to see me do anything else similar to this topic, please feel free to tell me and I'll, I'll be sure to try it. <sighs> anyway, Hemi Max Destroyer, you've just been destroyed.